Welcome to the credit video. For Let's Play Darksiders 2. So we're going off really quickly. I'd like to honestly salute every person listed on this screen. You've made an amazing product. And I, Burning Dog Face, am honored to have gone through it. <laughs> Sometimes it felt like I would never reach that video. That, uh, what's it called? That ending. This is far and away the longest video, uh, video series I have ever done. And I've been playing this game since November. And somehow it's only within the last week or so that I started to feel like I was burning out. That's a real good sign of a uh, quality game. Hmm. Credited for the Crucible. I wonder what that means. It was kind of odd to specifically credit the guys for what they did, you know. You don't see the artist who drew the, uh... The cauldron listed separately from the one that listed drew the, dr the drench fort. I wonder what that was about. The uh, axe, hammer, and mace. Well. Rest in peace, Vigil Games, and rest in peace, THQ. Your legacy will not be forgotten. I sincerely hope that, uh... There is a Darksiders 3 someday. I hope that the story is continued. And I hope that, uh, it lives up to the legacy of this game. You know, I'd actually heard that the last boss fight in this game was disappointing, but I didn't find it, so... It felt right. Short but sweet. Lamar was Bulgrim? Huh. A lot of Fred Tadaskiori in here. I listed uh, Simon Templeman as uh, the Avatar of Chaos. I think that might have been the guy who played John Irenicus in Baldur's Gate 2. I only remember that because he had a really distinctive, good villain voice. a shame this game didn't sell better, but from the way I heard it, it really, once THQ wasted all that money on the uh, U-Draw tablets, it didn't really matter how much their game was made. I wonder what possessed them to go into accessories. Well, like I said, I'm going to go hunting for the last things, and I'm if I ever manage to come face to face with uh, Gentleman Zombie, I'll be sure to make a special video for it and stick it in the end of this playlist. 
But, uh, looks like for now, it's finally the end of Let's Play Darksiders 2. I said this at the beginning of the day, but I'd like to thank you guys, every last one of you Burning Dog fans, for joining me on this journey. This game really meant a lot to me. And I'm uh, glad you could, you know, see it with me. I'm not saying there weren't rough spots or bits where I got extremely irritated, but... For the most part, I've got nothing but positive things to say about this game. My prince, I... The end war is upon us. Yet instead of the army you promised me, death has returned man to the balance. I await your punishment. This time, Lilith, you will get no pleasure from it. All right, then. The journey so far. The Lord of the Black Stone has vanished. His smile a promise. There is more to come. Will you find the strength to restore the Third Kingdom? Or is it your brothers who will emerge? Hmm. Well, as far as this video series goes, this is goodbye, Death. It's been real. I'm Burning Dogface, and this has been Let's Play Darksiders 2. Thank you for watching, <laughs> and I'll see you in whatever my next video series is. Later!